pastors say, I don't do politics, they're not honoring the second great commandment. The lie that the Bible is not political is an intentional lie. It's meant to convince us that we only have jurisdiction in the church. There's a good chance that you are not mainline, but you may very well be evangelical. You are now the largest religious group in the country, and you have rightly been called America's most powerful voting bloc. One response that we're supposed to have, and it is this, say it anyway, preach it anyway, speak it anyway. My political views are what they are because I love people. I want my kids and their kids to be free.